Hey, welcome to the show. Today in the show, we're gonna be doing a little bit of multiplication by a one digit number. The top part might be a two digit number or a three digit number. But before we start, I gotta ask you a question. Why did the scarecrow get an award? Because he was outstanding in his field. <laughs> Alrighty, right back here. Hey, if you got a joke to share, put it down in the comments. I'd love to also hear where you're from and, you know, maybe your favorite cookie, your pizza, or something interesting. 24 times 7. Now, when we do a problem like that, we're going to be kind of working with the ones first right here. So we're going to go 7 times 4. This is the direction we're going to be multiplying in. Then our second step where we'll be multiplying this number here. All right, so seven times four, 28. Remember, learn your multiplication. It makes things so much easier. So seven times four would be 28. Now, when you put the two, you would want to put a two here, but you take that two and you put it right up on top here, okay? Put the two right here. That two, you're going to add. Two, two. <laughs> We're going to be adding this two right here. So let's go ahead and do the next number. We're going to go in this direction here. So seven times two, 14, then add the two. 15, 16. That's all it is. Pretty simple. You ready to do another one? Yeah, let's do it. Yeah. All right, let's begin. Hey, at any time you want to pause the video, work on these problems, and then, you know, just go ahead and unpause it and hit play. So right now, if you want to pause the video, go ahead and do it. All right, welcome back to the show. Okay, here we go. 8 times 3. 8 times 3. 24. 24. Put the 4 right here. Put the two up here. Now, if you want to, you can put the plus sign up there just to kind of remind yourself that you're adding. But later on, I don't think you'll need to do that. But it's always nice to, you know, make it, make it easier on yourself. Eight times one, which would be eight, plus the two, 10. Put the 10 right there. 104 is the answer. Ready to do another one? Yeah, let's do it, yeah. All right, welcome back. Whoa, hey, don't worry. I know it's a three-digit number, but we're gonna take it easy, cheesy, lemon squeezy. Step by step, all right. Again, two times four, eight, all right. Now we're doing two times the one right here. Two times one is two. Buckle my shoe. Now we're gonna take the two and we're gonna multiply it to the number right here in the hundreds place. Two times two, four. What did I tell you? I know you could do it. You guys are math ninjas. Ready to do another one? Yeah, let's do it, yeah. All right, welcome back. This is a little tricky one. Now take your time. If you need to pause that video, go ahead and pause it, and then we'll work on it together. All right, let's, let's take it step by step. Remember, this number times this number. Eight times five, 40. So I'm gonna put the zero right here and the four up here. Now for this one, I'm gonna put that plus sign just so you know what's kind of going on here. Take it step by step. Eight times zero, zero, right? Yeah. Now we have zero plus the four, all right? So zero plus four, four. All right. I like throwing some challenging problems at you as I know you can handle it. Eight times four, what is it? 32, 32 right here. If you wanna put a little comma there, you can. There's our answer. Hey, you ready to try just one more? Yeah, let's do it. All right, welcome back. All right, now when you see a problem like that, what I like to do is rewrite it makes it a lot easier. So I'm just gonna simply just go put my, my 1,089. And you're like, whoa, that's a four digit number. Doesn't matter, I know you can handle it. Times three, now remember, three is, a, a, is in the ones place, so we gotta put it in the ones place. Don't put it over here, put it right over here with the nine, the, 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 Mr. Nine is right in the ones place. And we're gonna go ahead and put our Multiplication symbol there, and now we can do it step by step. Let's move on over here. Nine times three, 27. So we put the seven right here, the two up there. Hello, two. Next step, three times eight, three times eight, 24, 25, 26. Put the six right here, the two up there. Now make sure you got those numbers straight. You know, don't put, be putting them all over the place and, and write neat, okay? I always tell my students, don't, don't be sloppy in math. Three times zero, zero plus the two. Just bring that two right down. Three times one, three. Go ahead and put that comma. 
So the answer is 3,267. You guys did an excellent job. Give yourself a little pat on the back. Hey, uh, thanks a lot for watching my videos today. I'd love to hear your comments. I'm always reading the comments. Also, hit that likey button, and I would love it if you hit subscribe. And like always, have a fun day. Adios. Goodbye.